is Cake of 2000, and we are here today on Squadcraft. We need to break out of this little shell. As you guys can see right here, we have an Iron Golem spawner. Oh yeah, ah, we actually have had that for a while. Now, I made a checklist today, guys, during the past part of the and I'll explain why I wasn't practicing in the vlog that I do, and I'll explain all of that and stuff like that. So, look out for a vlog coming, and you will know why I did not practice today and all of last week. So, let's read down our list. Hold on, let me get it out. Okay, so, squad craft. We need to collect sands, get wood, boat. Uh, we need to raid starter bases, get obsidian, sell and make money, AFK at spawner for one or two hours, sell iron, get sand, and prove base, AFK for one hour, fill up chest, go AFK before bed, and then before school, get small key, and go AFK again. So, we're actually going to leave real quick, so we can go back in and get our small key. Now, we're not obviously going to do the AFKing, and we have to restart our game. We'll be right back, guys. Anyways, guys, the reason why we had to restart there is because I was AFK all yesterday and all night and then all morning. So I was AFK for at least 24 hours on Squadcraft all together, and it's lagging. All right, anyways, what I was saying is that obviously we're not going to do the AFK on camera that is going to be later for today my little checklist every single thing that we get done is an accomplishment um we don't have to go in the order but i would like to so we're just going to store that vote key in there and we're going to go back to it once we get to the voting part um we have the stone here as you know we use this to cover us up whenever we go afk but one of the things that it says on this list is to sell iron. So we're going to go down here and we're going to collect the iron that we got. Now, this is one spawner, guys. And I've been selling it like crazy. So you guys see, like, this little bit of iron. You may be thinking, why is the iron golem spawner even worth it? Well, it's worth it because you could literally, getting enough iron golem spawners, get a million dollars a day, depending on how many you have. Now, I've had... At the most Iron Golem spawners, I'm pretty sure I've had two or three. And I have earned over 500,000k a day. But then we got raided by friends, actually. And you guys may be thinking, how are they friends if they're raiding us and, you know, we get in arguments a lot because that's just our friend group. We like to have debates and stuff. So, those debates lead into things that you really care about. As you guys know, Dustin, Timmy, Timmy blew up our other base because uh, we accidentally killed him in Hunger Games. So, uh, that was bad, and I, you know, I'm happy with this, though, or we wouldn't have this base, and we wouldn't have this Iron Golem spawner, and we wouldn't have as much money as we have now. So, let's sell this iron. Okay, let's double-click it. Okay, so that gave us uh, I don't even know how much it gave us. A couple thousand, I think, maybe two or three thousand. Let's make this into oak wood. We're gonna go back to home. Um, what did I call it again? Uh, wait, let's just type in home. Yeah, home army. Now, guys, this is really exciting news. Hold on, let me just check off sell iron off our checklist. Anyways, this is really exciting news, guys. Um, as you know, this is called the Home Army, right? And these chests right here, we're trying to fill up with every single thing. So, um, we're going to fill this all up with stone, but most of the stuff is filled up here. We're going to fill it all up with dirt, sand, glass, this colored glass, um, this colored glass, this colored glass, every single colored glass, all the way down to all the glass is filled. We're going to fill it all up with coal ore blocks, uh, all with lapis lazuli, diamond ore, and down here is gold, I'm pretty sure. Uh, wood, we're going to get all the types of wood, sticks, redstone, you guys get it. Uh, is oak, okay, oak's over here. Now, what, what we're going to do is, me and the Big Ben Theory are going to work together. Because as you guys know, I am not very good at PvP. Okay, I'm actually probably 
a noob, even though I've played this for a while. I can PvP on Xbox, but I cannot PvP on squad, like on Squadcraft or Minecraft on PC in general. Unless it's against someone who's like never played before, you know? I was just trying to get up on top of those heads and it didn't work, but whatever. Anyways, oh, I'm going so I need to see it in action. Anyways, like I was saying, guys, um, me and the Big Ben Theory had an idea to basically combine forces, come together, and basically make an army. So we're gonna hire people. Okay, that's why we have the Iron Golem set up here. This is gonna be the army base, except that we're gonna take the Iron Golem spawner out so that people don't betray us and just take it and leave. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a whole army base. This is like supposed to be camouflage-ish, except the blue sky doesn't really make sense, but whatever. But this is gonna be the army base. We're gonna pay them to fight for us, to fight, raid, and collect things that we need. We're going to pay probably in real, um, like every Minecraft day, no, it's gonna be every Minecraft week, so once seven days go past or something, you get paid $5,000, depending on all that you got for us, but that may not seem like a lot, okay, but if we're playing for like five hours a day, you're going to end up getting a lot of money, but we're only gonna start this army once this Iron Golem spawner has accumulated to where we are getting around $500,000 every day. And I'm going to be going AFK like this on crazy. And it would be amazing if I could get the god rank from these vote keys. Because I've been voting for a very long time now. And it's one of my favorite things on squad. I really, really like it. Uh, and it would just be a great experience, guys, to be able to do that. Uh, okay, that's what I was looking for. Sorry, guys. <laughs> but, that's what I'm looking forward to do. If you guys want to join this army, you are more than welcome to. We are trying to get as many people, but I will warn you, if you do betray us, we'll have our army hunt you down, okay? Because then you will be on our enemy list. You don't want to be on our list, okay? If you're on our list, you will get killed. We will train our army, and we will find you and anyone else now some of you guys may take that as a challenge or whatever but i want you guys to be part of the faction i want to see your faces okay look at me i want to see your faces here on squadcraft okay we're gonna make a base together i'm probably gonna claim it so you're gonna have to be part of my faction the base is gonna be surrounded in bedrock the most important things are going to be only i can access to make sure that we have no betrayals in the faction and if we were to have it um have betrayals in the faction then like i said you will be hunted down because that will be treachery to our faction and nobody wants to get hunted down so just don't do anything that will get you hunted down okay now like i said we have a whole list to go through right now i'm looking at it because i have three other videos that i want to record today okay so i have a busy schedule and it is 6 23 because i had basketball like i said 6 23 and i gotta get three more videos done after this and one of them is like an hour long special so we have a lot of work to do so what we're going to do right now is go collect some sand that is one of my favorite things right now to do on Squadcraft because I think collecting sand is so much fun because this shovel is just so fast that it just makes it so fun. So let's go to shop again. Don't know why I came back here. And that's our automatic furnace. As you guys can see, we have a bunch of coal in it. So it really helps out. And look at that. Right in the sand biome right away. Okay, so we got to be careful. Like, we're going to eventually have, like, every block in the game that we need, that we will need in our faction. And right now, we're going to need glass, because I'm running through glass like crazy all the time, making different spawners, making bottles for potions, and having a lot of sand would just be helpful. You saw we had a whole double chest full of sand. That actually didn't take too long to get because once I set up the Iron Golem spawner, I felt that I could just go AFK. So what I do, guys, if you want, like, if you want to go AFK to spawner, 
but you still want to play or do something because you're bored, so you just end up not going AFK, but then not getting money or whatever you need it for, then listen to me, okay? What I do is I always leave, like, uh, Minecraft in the background. Hold on, let me see what's here. So, yeah, okay, so, here, look, I'll go AFK, just act like we're going AFK here, right? I'll go AFK, and it will smoke the sand for me, and the Iron Golem spawner will be running. So that's why I like to go AFK too. I, pr uh, I press T so I can go into another tab and I click my internet bar. Then I open this up and then I select a YouTube video to watch and it fills up my time. It goes very fast and then whenever I check back every once in a while, it's still going strong and I'm still getting all the supplies I need and want. So it's very easy, it's simple, and it's fun because you're still doing what you want to do by watching some of your favorite YouTubers while you are getting what you need done. Because I know going AFK is tedious, and if you like YouTube, that is the mechanism you should use because I use it and it works really well. And then of course you should go AFK before you get to bed if you really need to stop that bad, which I do. We're going to try to get the richest on the server. The richest person. Here, let's do this. Slash bow top. Uh, ordering balances. What? Oh, it's saying please wait. But I think the highest is 30 million. Okay, that's insane. Guys, that's really insane. I don't want to buy that super big. I was going to say should be. Oh, right, yep. Oh my gosh. The guy went up. Does. Oh my gosh. Does nug those nuggets though he just had 30,000 yesterday this guy has 62 million now no i'm sorry he had 30 million yesterday and now he has 62 million it's crazy i want to get up in those leaderboards i want to be feared okay i will fear that guy if i see him i'll try to make friends with him but if he says i'm coming after you Guys, you better believe that I will be scared. Unless, of course, I have the army to back me up. Because we could definitely take one person. We could take another army. As long as we have the good materials that we need. But I will still be very frightened. Because that guy probably has 5, 10 Iron Golem spawners. And he could afford to buy 62 Iron Golem spawners. That's insane. What are you going to do with that much money once you get that? I seriously don't understand, but trust me, I would like it. I would love to have that many Iron Golem spawners. That would be amazing. If you are, like, those nuggets, like, if you're subscribed to that, I mean, if you're committed to Squadcraft, good for you, because Squadcraft is an awesome server. And if you ever watch this video, like, I envy you. <laughs> I envy you, because I would love to have that much money on Squadcraft or in real life. I mean, I'll take it in real life, you know? But money isn't everything, and just playing the game and having fun is really fun. And I think that I'm at a good state of money right now, especially since I have at least one Iron Golem spawner, and I would be close to $2 million right now. And that's a big achievement for me. But we will strive for the top to have the most money on the leaderboards and be all the way up there. But once we get that money, we'll be able to pay you even more. We might be able to pay you guys 50000 every Minecraft week. That will accumulate very soon to $1 million, guys. If you just stick in that army, the more money I make, the more money you make. Okay? But the rule about the army is, is that when you go and kill someone, you can't hoard the money for yourself. Okay? That money is meant... Oh, chunk air. That money, I mean, that stuff you get, like the armor and swords and stuff, is going to be reused for the army again. And we're going to be collecting heads, so any heads you get go to us, and any god apples that you get go to us too, which will probably be reused again for the faction, or for uses that me and the Big Ben Theory may have. The Big Ben Theory is the general okay but I am the commanding officer no he's the commanding officer I'm the general 
but I do not go into battle with you guys. I supply you with potions, armor, weapons, and god apples. So whatever you get, like all the loot that you get from the army, you have to give to me. And any vote keys or anything that they have, I need to get that too because I can get armor and ranks from the vote keys. So that's the only thing you have to give me. Everything you get from the people that you kill during, like, when you're in the army. So if you're, like, if I'm off and you're not on duty, like, Ben didn't tell you to go out and PvP, practice up your skills, give him what you get, then if you go PvPing on your own, you're all good. And I'm going to be making a faction for that and recruiting people to come in. There's probably going to be that F home, okay? But that's after I move out the Iron Golem spawner and we do all that we need to do. So I think this is enough sand, guys. Let's get some acacia wood because that's what I just want to add this wood real quick because we have none in our base. So I want to add it to one of the chests. I just want to get a stack of this and then we'll be back, guys. This is... This is really amazing. I haven't had really, like, it's hard to explain. I haven't had an inspiration in a while, but seeing the leaderboards and stuff, that's a new inspiration on Minecraft. But I do not like how Minecraft is changing so much. Like, I like changes sometimes, but Minecraft seems to be getting a lot away from Minecraft. But I'm happy that YouTube is pretty much the same right now in that i'm getting subscribers every week now i think we have 46 subscribers let's try to hit 50 by uh what should we say let's try to hit 50 by november no 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 after october let's try to hit 50 guys that's only four more subscribers i really think we can do it thank you for watching my vids i I really appreciate it. You know, we'll be halfway to 100, which is my goal for till next summer. That's my goal. I want to hit 100. So that's a whole year, guys, that we could hit 100. Anyways, we'll be right back so that I can finish chopping down these trees. Okay, we'll be right back, guys. Guys, look at the base I just found. Um, I was just chopping the trees over there, and I saw this out the corner of my eyes. Um... I think it's rated yeah it has to be rated because you can see the uh where the blocks are missing there yep okay anyways we're gonna go back to the base so we didn't get a stack but we're still gonna go back uh i keep forgetting the name of this all right home army all right so so far guys we have two things no three things done on our list hold on let me check those off which is collect wood sell iron and get sand okay cool let's smelt the sand and i know this video is pretty long so far guys i'm sorry but i feel bad for not getting as much content out there anymore like i did before during the summer so this is going to be an extra long video it's probably going to be around 30 minutes please stick around to the end because guys Squadcraft is literally my favorite series, so if you stick around to the end, it might be a little surprise for you in the next video. If you can stick around, and if we can hit 10 likes, okay? Because I know you guys aren't very active, but there's 46 of you, so if we can hit 10 likes, there will be a surprise during, like, I don't know, I'll do like an hour-long special or a uh, challenge or something. You guys just tell me in the comments below, and I'll do it to the best of my ability. Alright. Ooh, two tripwire hooks. Bid! Two enchanted tripwire hooks. Cool. So we could get two. So now we're gonna vote. Okay. That's good, actually, that they did that. Oh, really? I'm not gonna bid again, because we're gonna be below uh, 700... It was 700 thousand you know we have more than that but we were already below and i don't want to go too below it unless it's worth it now i'm gonna i'm gonna bed because i pay oh that was 70k oh that would have been crazy all right i'm not going all the way to 100k i was about to say the other deals before like 100k so guys i'm gonna go through this voting process we'll be right back 
Guys, oh my gosh, I was so safe. I made the dumbest mistake. I was voting. He he was selling two enchanted trip wires for 10,000. I bid, but this guy right before I clicked the bid button, bid 99,000. And it made me go up. And then he saved me like 10 seconds later by bidding this much. I was so discouraged for a second. I was about to be so mad. Anyways, let's get to the voting like I said. Actually, let's go in our ender chest and get our small key. Can't forget about that. Okay. If you guys don't know, I did a little video about this, but the small key is what you get for logging in every day, and the vote keys are what you get from voting here on the Squadcraft website. You could get three at the most, unless it glitches or something. I always, like, always get stuff um, whenever you first put in... I always get food hit whenever you first put in your vote key. Oh, I didn't get it. Wait, what? We're lagging because I still have three vote keys. What? Guys, we are having a bad lag. Wait, did it? Guys, did we just cheat the system? What? No, it just took my vote key and didn't give me anything. That's really weird. Alright, 64 diamonds. I can roll with it. Roll, 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 roll. Alright, we're gonna sell all the stuff we get too, guys. One of the things I put down also was get obsidian. So, check that. See, brew kit, why? Alright, check obsidian. Oh, brew kit may not be working today. Maybe that's the problem. Alright, so we have a lot of things crossed off so far, guys. We're doing good progress. 64 emeralds. That was a super pick right there, guys. We just missed it. Oh, is that vote keys again? Yeah, that's vote keys. All right, let's bulk sell this, and we'll be on our way again. I said, do we have anything else? Uh, we filled up the chest kind of. Hold on, let me mark this off. Fill up chest and sell and make money. We did that too. Sorry guys, we're gonna raid starter bases next. I think. Oh, and we vote it. Guys, we're almost done with our list. We're like halfway through already. Maybe a little more. Alright, let's bulk sell this. Okay. Ooh, getting that cash. Getting that cash. You guys may be wondering what I'm going to do with the bedrock. So, we're going to go to my home. My vault. But this is not my main base. The army base. Base is my main place. But this is my most secure place. So, it's almost a full vault, and we're going to do the floor right now, because we kind of need a good floor. You know, a protected floor so no one can get through, and I'm so scared about placing this at the wrong place, guys. That would really stink, and I would be mad at myself for placing it in the wrong place. Oh, you guys don't know how scared I was for a second, because I, like, double-clicked my mouse, and I got so scared there. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys want to see what's in my vault, uh, zombie pig spawners, I need to set these up, but, I mean, I'm not very, like, I'm not gonna really go AFK at those. They don't give me much, I might just sell it, you know, that's what we're doing right now. We're auctioning these off. Um, yeah. Let's auction two for a hundred thousand, because that's as high up as we can go. Sixty... I'm a pro at this now, y'all. Okay. So, we're going to auction these off, and we're going to go back to our base. So, we're going to go home army. And we're going to, what did I say? Oh, raid starter bases. Well, we can't exactly raid starter bases just yet. Let's see how much sand. Um, I'm going to dye some of the sand. What is it? Yeah. Black. Because that's the next color we're going to do other than blue. But I just want to get this started. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. It's going to be harder to get in exact though. They seem very hard for me to find whenever I want to find them. Whenever I don't want to find them, they are easy. And I pass them up. And I'm learning not to pass them up now. Because I tend to need them in the path. In the future. Okay. As you guys, I don't know if you guys know, I don't know if I showed you, I won a super pick in, what's it called, um, in the vote keys before, 
and I ended up selling it, and I got 500,000 K, and that fulfilled, like, my goal, and that's how I got this Iron Golem spawner. But I also had an Iron Golem spawner, like I said, I sold that, and I got it, but, guys, Dustin got one, he got an Iron Golem spawner from Vokies, and he decides to mine it with the super pick because Timmy dared him to to mine it with the super pick and me and Dustin originally were sharing it. But like I said, he mined it with the super pick. So everyone hashtag Dustin plays is dumb. He did this a while ago though. I didn't tell you guys because I was barely recording on squad, which I apologize for so much. And after we raise these starter bases, we're gonna be done. I'm gonna finish the rest of the list probably off camera because I set some pretty high goals and I set that high of goals so that we weren't like under our goals by too much and that I could say that I actually did a lot because we did do a lot. We did extremely good and proficient. We weren't slacking in any department except whenever we had to restart our Minecraft. So let me just throw that down here. That's what I always do whenever I just spawn in the water. I just throw down the ender pearl, get as much breath as I can up here, wait till it hits, and then slash shop. We're trying to find a starter base right now, if you guys don't know why I keep going back and forth, but this is why. If we can't find a starter base, then we will just end it. And I'm sorry, guys, if you can hear that in the background. My dad is actually cutting our grass, so, and he's, like, using a lawnmower that you, like, sit in and drive. So, if you guys are wondering why you can hear a noise like that in the background, I'm sorry. I think he's about to be done anyways, so the other video should be good. Look out for the next videos. I will be uploading now two or three videos a day. Guys, that is a high goal for me. I'm sorry if I don't fulfill it every day, but trust me, I will make up for it the next day. If I do not do it the that day that I miss, and I will give myself a consequence of some sort whenever I can figure out some good consequences to do. Um, I know my first consequence is probably going to be an ice bath, so look forward to that, guys. I love the cold, okay, but I'm not looking forward to getting blocks of ice dumped on my head. So, you know, we'll be right back, guys. We're going to try to find a starter base. If we can't find a starter base, then the video will end. Oh! The speak of the devil starter base right down here. All right, let's go. Sorry if you can hear that noise again, guys. All right, so it looks like they raided all the diamonds and stuff. But what I don't understand is why no one ever takes the iron or anything or the wood. We're trying to get remember full chests of wood, so I always take this now. And the reason why we're trying to get so much of everything, like a double chest of everything is because it's for the army that's the army storage so i want the army to be heavily supplied with anything they may need or want and another person is auctioning that wait our spawners didn't go up wait did someone bid? guys guys i didn't see someone bidding oh but wait a second tyler oh tyler said hey wait a second someone bid for our stuff guys I'm gonna have to watch the video back because I did not see that and I can't go up any farther. Hold on. Slash MSG Tyler plays. Hey, recording say hi. But guys, they must have bid a lot for that because we were at 773, no, 743,000. I mean, 100,000. So, they had to bid pretty high for that. I'm going to send that to Tyler again. He may have not sold that. Wow. I was just, like, oblivious to anything going around me except what I was saying and what we were doing. Alright. So, <laughs> I was really surprised by that. Alright, I'm going to bid, but I'm going to be careful. How much are they bidding already? Alright, I'll top that. Okay. Someone's topping me. I'm not going to go into a bidding war, guys, because we're less than 200,000 away from another iron golem spawner like that's amazing guys because just last week i was at like 300,000 k because we bought the iron golem spawner so it's pretty awesome oh okay what do we need and what don't we need 
Um, hey, just throw my steak on the ground. The steak that I was eating before. Alright, let's throw all these out. Okay. Um, come on, guys. Oh, yeah, if you guys don't know how to do the trick to um, throw out w more than one item at a time, you do control Q. I know I always wondered how to do that for a long time. We're going to keep the sand because we're probably going to need it. I don't like brew kit, okay? I'm sorry if that's one of the kits you guys want me to keep or something, but I hate kit brew. I literally hate it. It fills up my inventory. It's not fun. I don't need the stuff. It's just a waste of time to tell you the truth. Alright. Let's throw this all out because I really don't want it and I don't need it. <laughs> Does he have more stuff? Oh! Ah! Thank you. I'll take the ender pearls because I'm very fond of them. I'll take the bow. I'll take the armor. Ah! Even though it's almost broken and it's not that good. I'll still take it. And I'll take those ender pearls. Okay. Well, I guess I just broke what I didn't want to take, but whatever. Alright, so this person, this was obviously a base of theirs, but never leave stuff in a starter base. These diamond blocks must have been from when when you logged on every day, they gave you diamond blocks. And I saw that shovel. I'm getting that shovel. Oh, that's better than my shovel now, so thank you. I'm going to throw the armor out. I really don't need it. It's protection, too. It's crap. And these. And this. But, all in all, that was a pretty good raid. Even though it wasn't like a big raid, but it was still a raid. And there's another starter base. I'm going to go raid this, guys. Anyways, this is the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. I will be uploading two or three videos a day. So look up, look out for that. I love you all so much. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for that new subscriber. And thank you for that very first subscriber. And thank you for any subscriber. Thank you for the first all the way to the 40th. Thank you. Oh, sorry, not 40. <laughs> Thank you for the first already all the way up to the 46. This is more than I could have dreamed up. Thank you guys so much. I love y'all and goodbye.